We connect to the vision and we run with the vision of the leader. Connecting brings results. And I'm smiling here because we have been for weeks now hearing about Nehemiah. And I'm gonna put him right here, right now. We've been hearing about him for weeks. He was given the responsibility to rebuild the wall. And we know what happened. Hmm? He had the message and the mission. However, he had to endure the mocking and the mischief. He stayed connected to the vision, not being distracted by requested meetings. Nehemiah was committed, but he was not alone. The people was committed with him. They refused to cease, stop building the wall. They refused to come off the wall. They stayed connected until the purpose was achieved. The wall was rebuilt. And we heard that it only took 52 days to rebuild that wall. Why? Because they were connected. They worked in unity. One wasn't pulling that way and the other one pulling this way. Okay, you build this piece. Oh, it doesn't look good. Let me break it down. You know, they stayed and they worked together in unity. And then there was accomplishment. After that, they had time now to be built up by the word of God because that aspect of their journey was completed. The walls were rebuilt. The more we stay together, the greater the accomplishment. We can name some accomplishments out of Shekinah, can't we? We can look back and name a lots of accomplishments that God has brought us through. And you know what? He didn't bring us through because we were disconnected. He brought us through because we were connected. We saw the vision. We ran with the vision. We supported the woman of God in the vision. And God gave victory. God gave blessings because of our connectivity. Stay connected.